And let's take a look at our first story. The vehicle of India's Shaj Defez Gaurav Aluwalia has been chased by a motorcyclist in Pakistan today. Cell phone video of the incident shows an individual appearing to chase the diplomat's vehicle across the city. Now, reports say that Pakistan's inter-services intelligence has tasked multiple persons in cars and bikes to track his movements and even outside his residence to harass and intimidate him. Now, we have our correspondent, Sadan Sibyl, joining us for more on this, uh, on this incident. Good evening to you, Sadant. What is the latest information that you have for us? Well, Alison, this was on expected lines because, uh, remember, on Sunday, India caught two Pakistani officials uh, red-handed while trying to indulge in espionage activities in the heart of Delhi, in Karol Bagh. Uh, after that, India had declared them persona non grata. They were expelled and they left India within 24 hours. Now, this incident has happened. In fact, this incident happened on Sunday itself when the when India's top diplomat, uh, the Deputy High Commissioner, we do not have a High Commissioner there. He was expelled last year after the Pulwama ter terror attack and, of course, the Indian reaction, the surgical mm -hmm. uh, strike. And the top diplomat was aggressively chased by men in motorcycle. We also know that the top diplomat, uh, Gaurav Alwalia, his uh, residence uh, was surrounded by these uh, these uh, unknown personnel in uh, plain clothes. And then, of course, we know that uh, these personnel will, were key, keeping uh, uh, an eye on him. Of course, we, ha we know that the harassment of uh, Indian diplomats in Pakistan is not new. It has been happening in the past uh, as well. In fact, in 2019, in 2018, we know how in Mass were harassed. Uh, in fact, lights were cut off of, of, at the residences of Indian diplomats uh, during peak of winter in Islamabad. Islamabad is a city in mountain, uh, mountains and of course uh, it is very cold and of course we know uh, that anyone who goes and meets the Indian diplomats, uh, journalists or anyone, they are aggressively question when they come out. So this is nothing new, but they come at a time when Pakistan is looking for opportunity to kind of take back at India after India caught two of its officials red-handed trying to espionage mm -hmm. the heart of Delhi. And we also know that four years ago, such kind of incident happened when India had caught a Pakistani official uh, trying to indulge in spy activities there in Delhi. Mm -hmm. And uh, to retaliate that back then, the Pakistani government had expelled an Indian High, uh, official at the High Commission, and this time also this was expected, uh, but clearly uh, it, it looks like frustration in Pakistan, and that is why Pakistan is indulging in such activities. Right, so then thank you very much for joining us for the latest on that. That's our principal diplomatic correspondent, Sadan Sobol, joining us for more on that story.